one of the things that we practice in Kundalini is sound. How do we use sound to enable our physical instrument to be able to resonate with the contributing field that surrounds everything? How can that contributing field, which contains all of the information that we need, how can we absorb and translate that information into our navigation so that we can be successful in each moment? Nearly everyone knows about chakras. And even the chakras being different colors, the chakras are also different tones. From the lowest tone of C sharp sharp to the highest tone of a, uh, of a B sharp sharp. And all of that in between is affecting every gland and every organ in your body. And so the tones, the attitudes have tones. All of these components have tones. Whatever your attitude, whatever your words, whatever you're practicing can be concentrated into a daily routine that you can set aside some time so that you can then focus your physical body, your emotional body, and your mental bodies, the three brains plus all of the facets of those, into being very clear and able to navigate the moments. It's like all of the equipment on a ship from if it's a sailing vessel, from the sails, to the rudder, to the keel, to the navigational equipment, all of it is focused on arriving at the destination. This is translated into our physiology through the chakra system, which is then coming from, as I said, that informational field that surrounds each and every one of us, it surrounds the planet, it surrounds the solar system, it surrounds the galaxy, it just keeps surrounding and surrounding. It's what that holographic science demonstrates. Every part is equal to the whole. Oh.